Driscoll drove with the song, the wild duck and the drake, from the tall and the tufted reeds of the drear heart lake. And he saw how the reeds grew dark with the coming of night tide. And he dreamed of the long, dim hair of Bridget, his bride. And he heard, as he sang and dreamed, a piper piping away. And never was piping so sad. Never was piping so gay. And he saw young men and young girls who danced on a level place. And Bridget, his bride, among them with a sad and a gay face. The dancers crowded around him and many a sweet thing said. A young man brought him red wine, a young girl white bread. But Bridget drew him by the sleeve away from the merry bands to old men playing at cards with a twinkling of ancient hands. The bread and the wine had a doom, for these were the hosts of the air. But he sat and played in a dream of her long, dim hair. He played with the merry old men and thought not of evil chance, until one bore Bridget, his bride, away from the merry dance. He bore her in his arms away, the handsomest young man there, and his neck and his breast and his arms were drowned in her dark, grim hair. For Driscoll scattered the cards, and out of the dream awoke, and old men and young men and young girls were gone, like drifting smoke. But he heard high in the air a piper piping away, and never was piping so sad. Never was piping so gay.